Welcome to my channel. I've been asked to react to Dimash singing Omir Otter. I think that's how it's pronounced. O-M-I-R-O-T-E-R. -E Omer Otter. And I'm going to do that now, but before I do that, I want to thank you for coming to my channel. I want to thank you for the unbelievable growth of my channel. I had just barely 10,000 subscribers yesterday, and today I have almost 10,400. I don't know what's going on, but you guys are subscribing like crazy. It's amazing to me. It really is. And I'm very, very thankful for it. So thank you very much. <coughs> and I'm very, very thankful for it. So thank you very much. I really do appreciate it. As I do with every artist that I feature on my channel, I'll go to Dimash's channel, I'll get all his links, and I'll put them into the description of my video. All you have to do is click on the more link on my description and you'll see those links. What I ask you to do is to subscribe to the cha YouTube channels and follow the social media accounts and buy the music of the artists that I feature if you like their music. So this is Dimash Kudai Bergen singing Omer Otter. Oh, 
If you're taking a trip with your f hmm. Well, <clears throat> one thing that I really enjoy about Dimash is his sets. He does the most fantastic sets, and this one was no exception. The, the, the appearance of being in a forest was just incredible. It really was very realistic. Until you look at it and you realize he's actually on a stage, and you see the lights up the top, so you know it's on a stage, but yet it looks very real. And I love the way that he incorporates the... the uh, instruments of his native land of Kazakhstan into his music. I can't, I still can't say what that is. I, I can't pronounce it or anything, but I know you guys have told me a hundred times and maybe after I get a hundred more, I'll, I'll actually remember it. But anyway, um, I saw that, that same two string instrument in the background being played. And at the end of it, uh, playing it with a bow, like a violin almost. And I thought that was really cool. His voice, of course, is the best ever. Um, I mean, there's just no question about that. Uh, you know, I've done now a hundred reactions to him, and I'm I'm starting to get him. I'm starting to to understand where he's coming from. And I think a couple reactions ago, I said that. Um, he doesn't become the song. He is the instrument from which the song comes. And I think I want to amend that. Because he is not the performance. He is not the performer. He is the performance. If that makes any sense. Think of what I said before about him being the instrument from which the song comes. Well, he's the performance from which the performance comes, if that makes any sense. He's just, uh, you know, it's, it's hard. It's hard to describe Dimash in words that make sense. It really is. Because he's so uh, incredible in every aspect of it. It's not just the voice. It's not just the song. It's not just the performance. It's the whole, it, it's not just the set. It's the whole package is superior in every way. 
and, and enjoyable in every way. And this particular song I, I liked a lot. I thought it, it just displayed everything that Dimash is and everything that he, he does and portrays him in a way that shows you exactly what he's all about. Uh, he's just, uh, <laughs> words are so cheap. Amazing is the word that came to mind, but I mean, that doesn't really describe it. That's, you know, how do you get above? What's above amazing? Uh, spectacular? I don't know, but uh, he really is one of a kind. He He's certainly one of a kind in everything that he does, not just the singing, not just his voice. And by the way, I, I got to get this off my chest. I had a commenter come in to the, to the channel last night and said some very uh, uh, what's the word? He was very uh, he deg he gosh how do I put this? I don't want to tell you what he said because uh, I don't want to give him any spotlight at all but he, he denigrated Dimash and he's now banned from my channel because he did it two two separate times and doubled down on it when I called him on it. And uh, he was just really nasty. And look, if if you're watching this and you're at all inclined to do that sort of thing, just know I just ban you. I don't need this crap on my channel and I won't put up with it on my channel. So... You know, if, if you want to be like the typical internet troll that comes on channels and says all kinds of denigrating stuff and stupid stuff and, and inflammatory stuff, go ahead. I will ban you and I will delete all of your comments. It will be like you never existed on my channel. And that's the way it's always going to be. So just don't even bother to try it, okay? Because I read every comment... I pay attention to what's going on, and I don't put up with baloney, period. Especially not when it comes to a performer of the status of Dimash. Not going to happen. But it's not going to happen with anybody that I feature on my channel. If I feature somebody on my channel, they need to be treated with dignity and respect, and you need to comment on them. If you, if you want to say something that you didn't like their performance, that's fine. I don't care. You can not like it all you want. There's performances that I haven't liked, and I've said so. But you cannot come on my channel and get negative and get nasty. That will get you banned right now. Get all your comments removed, and you'll never be back on my channel again. Because I don't unban people once they're banned. I've dealt with you people on the Internet for decades. And I know that you don't change your spots. So just don't even bother to try it, okay? Just a word to the wise. But for all the people that do come to my channel and are so lovely and wonderful and sweet, for you, I pray. I pray that you will have an abundant life that you will live a long time, that you'll be healthy, and that God will keep you safe from harm. I pray that he will do the same thing for every person that you love. But I pray most of all that you will be anxious for nothing. But in all things, through prayer and supplication, with thanksgiving, you will make your requests known to God. And the peace that passes all understanding will keep your heart and mind in Christ Jesus. This is the Vietnam Era Vet out.